Christ. We had a lot of conflicts in our marriage. We argued sometimes, we quarreled. We had separated a few months before joining the church. They had many debts in their credit cards. They would only pay the minimum payment. And we never managed to prosper because they only paid the minimum payment. They couldn't even get to sleep, thinking of how to pay off the debts. At that time, we lived in a two-bedroom apartment with a living room, a kitchen, and one bathroom. And we had no parking space for us. We had to park the car someplace else because we couldn't park it inside the condo and the apartment didn't have much space. It was a 47 square meter apartment. I wished I had a bigger place for my pets. I have three dogs. It was difficult for us to accommodate our pets. So I had the same wish to go to a house. I would rather live in a house than in an apartment. It was our intention. They used to have an old car. My mother converted in another denomination in 2003, and she was always trying to get my father to join her. Then in 2005, it happened that my dad joined the Grace of God Church and they started attending it together until the present day. In 2005, Angela became a sponsor. I attended the services at the church. I answered the calling to be a sponsor. I obeyed it and became a sponsor. When they started to attend the Grace of God Church, their finances began to improve and they began to have money left. Then they could pay off their debts gradually. After paying the debts, we managed to save some extra money in order to purchase a house, our own house. Today, the house we live in has three bedrooms, a spacious living room, a kitchen, a bathroom, a spacious garage, a front patio and a backyard where we drink our tea on weekends. The house they bought in 2008 has an area of 115 square meters of great comfort. There's space for our pets. When we bought this house, it was good for them as well. It was good for us and for them. And because we had money left, we sold the old car and bought a new one. In 2015, my parents gave me a car. The garage is big enough to accommodate two cars, and it's all because God did stretch his hand and, and because of God's help, we bought this house. That same year, we bought our house. Today, we don't have any debts. That nightmare of past due bills is long gone. Today, we pay them on their due date. I am very thankful to God for the resources. Our financial life has improved a lot. We still pay the sponsorship faithfully. My wife is a sponsor, and through her sponsorship, we reach we reach the world, right? The sponsorship helps to spread the Word of God to the world. We help it somehow through the sponsorship. And uh, those who benefit are the world population because they receive the Word of the Lord. We feel the presence of God. We never fail to go to church. Through Dr. Suarez's program on TV, the couple learned how to live in peace and unity. My marriage is restored. Today, my parents have a quiet life. Thanks be to God. My parents sleep better. They truly enjoy life because today our financial life is stable. Today, things are wonderful, a blessing. Thank God for all the blessings I've received so far. By thinking of what God can give us, we can achieve things that are really inexplicable to our own sight. We are very thankful to God. Glory to God. Deliverance!